to Project Mixologist. I'm Jason Catalano, and on this channel, we make mixed drinks with spirit flavorings. And on this video, we'll be going over the Schwarzenegger smoothie, or a peanut butter and banana smoothie. And this is part of our breakfast protein smoothie series. All right, welcome back, everybody. And so for this smoothie, this is going to be the Schwarzenegger smoothie. And just give a little overview of this smoothie. It is, you know, just like Arnold Schwarzenegger, it's going to be high protein. Uh, your main flavors in this are going to be peanut butter, banana, a little bit of honey, and obviously, kind of the, the what we the way that we designed the smoothie is that it's going to have a lot of protein. It's going to have some nice dark leafy greens in it, and that this is a great breakfast smoothie if you want a little bit more protein. Uh, you want to get some nice dark leafy greens in, but you don't want the greens to be overwhelming. So once again, that this is the Schwarzenegger smoothie, and let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and make it. All right, so this smoothie actually comes in about 420 calories, 45 grams of protein, big protein coming in. With that, we're gonna start off with the almond milk. And with the almond milk, we're gonna be doing three quarters of a cup. First one that goes in is the liquid. So the almond milk pretty much is just giving us a uh, liquid base and not a whole lot nutritionally with it. It's just, it's low calorie, a little bit better tasting than water. Next up, what we're gonna to wanna to do is do Greek yogurt, half a cup. So Greek yogurt is going to give us good probiotics, good for the tummy, and this is a great source of protein. Uh, the actual Greek yogurt, the way they do it is they take the yogurt and they take out a lot of the water and they take out a lot of the lactose. So if you're lactose intolerant, this is another good option. Okay. So next what we're going to do is we're going to add in the spinach. This is a full cup of spinach. Uh, I use frozen spinach just to make it more creamy and the spinach lasts a little bit longer. Spinach, definitely good, just overall one of the best powerhouses of vegetables. Great dark leafy green, it's good for everything in the body. So we just add those in. Okay. Next we have banana. So banana, mostly it's, for fruits it's not one of the most nutritional. Uh, it does add a nice, good, mellow sweetness. It does give you some potassium. It will help a little bit with cholesterol, but usually when you put banana in, it's mostly for the natural sweetness and for very lower amounts of, of general nutrition. Next, what we're gonna do is add in a teaspoon of honey. Okay, so the honey is pretty much just gonna be our sweetener on this. And all you need is just a little bit. Usually with honey, a little bit will go a long way. You're not gonna get a whole lot of honey flavor, but it will just cancel out those dark leafy greens just enough. All right, so next we're gonna have two tablespoons of peanut butter fit. You can use regular peanut butter here, but peanut butter fit actually has about a third of the calories, a little bit more protein, and basically what they do is they just they cut out a lot of the fat. So this is a lower fat option. If you want to add in a little bit of actual peanut butter, by all means go ahead, but it will increase the calories significantly. Throw that in. Next we have one scoop of protein powder. Use any choice protein powder you want. I just get this one at the local commissary. And biggest thing this is giving us is our protein source. This one's got 25 grams of protein. So main protein source. There we go. And our last ingredient, which is obviously why we're calling it the Arnold Schwarzenegger, is cedar oak flavoring. So this is an essence that normally goes into a lot of different type of liquors. Specifically, if you think about Irish whiskey and the type of oakness you get from that, that's what this is. You can find this on Amazon anywhere locally. So this is going to be one milliliter of cedar oak. So this is going to give a nice oaky flavor to it. And it's not going to overwhelm it. So at one milliliter, it's not going to overwhelm. If you want more oak, increase that to one and a quarter. If you want less oak, three quarters of a milliliter. All right, so with that, let's go ahead and let's blend. Okay, so after about 30, 45 seconds, we'll go ahead and pour this into our glass. As you can see, it's a nice, light green. You can see, very creamy. Perfect. 
So, there you go. This is the Schwarzenegger recipe right here for the smoothie. So, as you can see looking at it, it's got this nice bright greenness to it. It's got some of that spinach. They got pulverized, you can see it. So the smell, nothing really off the nose. Yeah, it's actually a really interesting smoothie. Once again, you don't really get the dark leafy greens. You don't taste any of the spinach, even though you get a full cup's worth of spinach. It's a very mellow peanut butter banana. Uh, but the honey actually does mellow out the spinach just enough to where the peanut butter and banana are really will come through. It's not really as rich as normal peanut butter, but it's a very, very mellow version of a peanut butter banana smoothie. Uh, pretty shocked actually how good this is. So second taste. Okay, second taste, the peanut butter comes in a lot more. You definitely get peanut butter extremely creamy. So this is very creamy. Uh, you don't get little shards and stuff like that coming through of the spinach. Honey, not so much. The oak comes in a little bit at the end. And the oak kind of gives it this kind of complexity of character versus just a straight peanut butter banana. Overall, I would definitely say if you like peanut butter banana as a flavor combo, you're looking for a good protein source for a morning smoothie, I would definitely recommend the Schwarzenegger smoothie. Mm. Yeah, once again, mellow, good peanut butter, banana kind of comes through. Not a lot of the honey, not a lot of the spinach though, so it's just a mellow peanut butter, uh, peanut butter banana smoothie. I say. All right, thank you for taking uh, your time and watching this video all the way to the end. If you can, go ahead and comment down below your favorite part about the Schwarzenegger smoothie and let me know what your thoughts are, if there's any good variations or any other types of ingredients you'd like to see, another type of Schwarzenegger smoothie you'd like to see. Go ahead and comment and be sure to subscribe if you want more smoothies. And with that, this is uh, Jace Catalano. Giddy up.